Hey everyone, welcome back to another Call of Duty Mobile before you buy video. Today we're diving into everything you need to know about the Mythic Ghost Eternal Siege. I'll break down all the rewards in this Mythic Drop and help you decide if it's worth your hard earned CP. A big shout out to Murderblast and JC Rosethorne for the awesome clips. You can find their links in the description below. So let's kick things off by taking a closer look at the star of this Mythic Drop, the Mythic Ghost himself. He's the fourth mythic character in Call of Duty Mobile. So what do you get when you unlock him? First off, you get a skin for Ghost Scout class called Savage Riley in Battle Royale. It might seem a bit unusual to use Riley as a scout, but since Riley is linked to the K9 unit, you also get the K9 unit as Savage Riley. Pretty cool, right? Next up, we have the Hollow Watch, which displays the number of kills you rack up in a match. We also have a loot box that's quite similar to the legendary character loot boxes we usually see, because you're going to get everything a legendary character has. The extra bonus here is the MP debut, which gives you a unique pose when opening a new round in multiplayer. Like any other legendary character, you'll also get a drop stance. So that's the complete package you get when you unlock Mythic Ghost. Now that we've covered the base features, let's dive into the upgrades menu. This is where you'll enhance the existing features with a set of upgrades. To unlock the advanced form, you need to get 7 out of the 9 available upgrades. The upgrade in the middle is the advanced form, which you achieve once you've collected those 7 upgrades. There are 3 main sets of upgrades. The arm tech upgrade, the battle tech upgrade and the color tech upgrade. Each set contains three items you can upgrade. Starting with the arm tech upgrade, the first upgrade is a hollow screen saver. This is essentially a screen saver for your hollow watch and is one of the less impactful upgrades for mythic characters. The second upgrade is for Gesture and Watch Face. This includes an emote in first person view known as the Gesture and additional customization options for your hollow watch face. The third upgrade is the Arm Modify. This one is a game changer because it grants you a special execution move. This upgrade is a must have in my opinion. The special execution includes Riley with Ghost using his sickle to finish off the enemy. It might be the most brutal execution we've seen in COD Mobile so far. Next let's move on to the Battle Tech upgrade. The first Battle Tech upgrade is the Loot Box variant. You've seen the base loot box you get when you unlock Ghost. But with this upgrade you get an enhanced Loot Box variant where you can place the flag for Mythic Ghost. When you go near the Loot box and place it, it looks stunning. The second battle tech upgrade is for the skydive and transport plane. This upgrade changes the skin of the huge flight you see at the start of a battle royal match. Instead of the usual plane, you get this upgraded version which I think is pretty awesome. The third battle tech upgrade is the skill set variant. This upgrade enhances the battle royal class and the multiplayer operator skill. It's an upgrade to the skin you get when you unlock mythic ghost, giving you an upgraded version of the K9 unit and the scout class. Now let's move on to the third upgrade category, the color tech upgrade. First, you'll see two colors, Twilight and Storm Cloud. These colors change the armor of the Mythic Ghost, giving it a fresh look. Next, we have the second color tech upgrade. This upgrade also changes the same areas of the armor, but this time the colors are animated and dynamic, labeled as legendary colors. Because of their enhanced visual effects, you'll have to pay extra for them. With this upgrade, you unlock colors like Mystic, Bloodstone, Viridian, and Umbra. Then we move on to the final color tech upgrade, which changes the inner color or the soul color of Mythic Ghost. This upgrade alters the effects color of Mythic Ghost, significantly transforming his appearance. These colors are more impactful because they change the core look of Mythic Ghost. The options available are Revenant, Noxious and Glacial. If we talk about these colors, you can create up to 18 different color combinations by mixing and matching colors in Zone A and Zone B. With the original and advanced forms, you effectively get double the amount of color sets. For even more customization, you can opt to use a single color in one zone and leave the other zone without any color. If you don't equip any zone B colors, you'll experience the natural fire effect instead of colored fire like Revenant, Noxious or Glacial. This means you have total control over how your mythic ghost will look in the game, making it highly unlikely that you'll encounter another mythic ghost with the exact same appearance on the enemy team. Out of all the colors, I would go with Noxious in zone B because it pairs perfectly with the OG G series backpack from season 1. That combo is everything for me. Let me know what your favorite color combo is in the comment section below. Those are all the 9 upgrades you can get. Now once you've managed to secure 7 out of these 9 upgrades, you'll unlock the advanced form. With this advanced form, you'll get the Mythic Ghost's final modification and the MVP screen. Look here Riley, pay attention! When you enter a new lobby, you'll see Riley bringing Ghost the Seeker. Pretty cool, right? So you might be wondering, does the Mythic Ghost have any special features that other Mythic characters don't? The answer is yes, it does. Let me break it down for you. 
First off, at the end of the scout class, you'll notice that Riley follows you around. The same feature happens with the K9 unit in multiplayer. It's a neat little easter egg feature that's exclusively available when you're equipped with Ghost's K9 unit Savage Riley in multiplayer or Ghost's Scout Savage Riley in Battle Royale. But remember, it's only visible to you. After you've activated the skill and completed it, a countdown will start. During this countdown, Savage Riley will stay by your side and move with you for a little extra time. But once the countdown ends, Riley will disappear automatically. You won't be able to walk him again until you've triggered another round of Ghost's K9 unit or Ghost Scout class. A brand new pet feature is coming out for those of you who have Mythic Ghost Riley in your inventory. You'll be able to pet Riley, customize by changing his appearance or feed inside your safe house. How cool is that? Now for those of you aiming to pull Mythic Ghost in your first spin, your chances are just 0.08%. So it's definitely a rare find. Before we dive into the other rewards available in this Mythic drop, I want you to check out all the Mythic Ghost voice lines. Huge shout out to Leakers on Duty for bringing these. The memories of their faces come to haunt me at night. In the choir, I hear their screams. It's all a special kind of hell. We are what our pasts have made us. We gotta stick together if we're gonna make it out alive. All the parts of yourself you sacrifice in order to survive. In the end, what survived isn't you anymore. There's no one better suited to this mission than me. I don't trust people, only dogs. Look here, Riley, pay attention. You got a death wish. Riley, get at him. Observe, adapt, overcome. I try not to live a life of regret. At the end of the day, I'm just a weapon. Thought you'd get away, did ya? Ghosts are more afraid of the light than the dark. You can't kill a ghost. Sorry, mate. You never stood a chance. I can't look back. A man could go mad obsessing about his past. Hope there's a hell, because you deserve more than just death. Good job out there, old boy. While we wait, the enemy prepares. Let's dive into the second best item in this mythic drop, the legendary KN44 Dark Harbinger. Here's my honest take on it, they've really gone all out with this one. The level of detail is impressive. You'll notice some amazing effects on the gun, giving it a fiery and dangerous look. Plus, it has a fantastic iron sight and looks super clean overall. One of the coolest features of this legendary weapon is the kill effect. It shows a quick shadow or glimpse of mythic ghost. It's subtle but really adds to the mystique of the gun. Drop your thoughts in the comment section below. By the way, the KN44 has a 1.25% chance of dropping in your first spin so many of you should be able to snag it within 4 or 5 spins. Let's move on to the other rewards in this mythic drop and the odds of getting them. First up with a 4% chance we have a HDR skin. This skin is animated but it doesn't come with different geometry which is a bit disappointing for a mythic drop. It's not something I'd be thrilled about. Next we have the From the Ashes emote which has a 4.67% chance of dropping. This emote shows the transformation from the base form to the advanced form of mythic ghost. While it's not the most exciting emote for a mythic drop, it's decent. The sickle skin called Epitome has a 5.5% chance of dropping. This is a fantastic looking melee weapon and I'm glad it has such high odds. Many of you will be able to grab it early on. Then there's the Eternal Siege Calling Card with a 6.5% chance. This calling card features both Mythic Ghost and the legendary KN44 and it's a nice addition to the drop. Let's finish up with the remaining rewards in this Mythic drop. The helicopter skin has a 10% chance and the jetpack skin comes in at 11%. Honestly, neither of these really catch my interest. Then we have the Storm Bowl skin and the charm with odds of 28% and 29% respectively. I do like the charm because it's inspired by Riley. So when it comes to the other rewards besides the Mythic Ghost and the legendary KN44, I'm not too excited. Is it worth buying this Mythic drop? Absolutely, because of the Mythic Ghost and KN44. Apart from those, I don't see a strong reason to buy this drop. But hey, let me know what you think about this Mythic drop and how many spins you're planning to do. What are you most interested in? Leave a comment and share your thoughts with everyone. And that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you found this video helpful, please leave a like. Make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any updates. Check out my other videos and I'll see you guys in the next one.